Hello guys, sweet inspiration, Alethea here again. Here is another video for you. This is New Look 6791. And as you can see, it's an easy just for knit pattern. So here is my knit and there is the pattern. As you can see, I already cut it out and based it together. This is a simple top. Here are your pattern pieces. And it's only four pieces. In the beginning, so, they ask you to label your le left and right pieces so you can't so you won't get confused. And here is the sleeve. I basted it enough together so I can try it on to see how it measure. As you can see on my body, as you can see, it's it's cropped a lot more than I would like it and by me being small I thought that it would hit me just where I wanted and it wouldn't be too long and plus because of the hem so did not but we going on with it anyway and the reason behind laboring it your um, pieces is because you got to attach these pieces on the um, back side of your garment the section that I'm talking about here, I'm going to try to give you a close-up view of that. This is the back piece right here. This is the um, right side of your top. And this is your left side. And they want you to sew three inches from the bottom edge up to the top. Then you're going to do a hem and zigzag or stitch and the stitch is going to be a quarter of an inch two times from the edge of your hem and so guys i call this a little top the top with the twist because of this little feature right here or the crisscross little top as you will see in a moment this is the little fun part that i like they're asking you to flip it over to the right side and then you're gonna let the left side hang loose for a minute and then you're gonna take the right side which is this and you're gonna place it with the tops and this is your back and you're gonna um meet your um shoulder seams i thought that was really neat i was wondering how it was gonna play out i think i'm gonna like the little top but also i could have went up another size larger had i known it was gonna be this snug and it wasn't gonna give me any room to play with as far as the length is concerned i don't like the really crop crop so you're not going to sew the side seams after you uh, attach your shoulder straps. You're going to pin it. And you'll see why in a minute. Okay, so then they're asking and you're going to pin your other side. Then they're asking, remember that this is going to be looking like this because you sewn up that seam already three inches and you placed your hem so they're asking you next to put your shoulder seams together for your left side at the top the top comes together pretty easily and then you sew from top down to about here because remember the three inches you already sewn up plus that hem and here you can see where that cross is coming into right here and here when it's all put together I'm going to clip it for now 
so I can flip it over and give you a visual for how it actually looks. Let's flip. And flip. And that's how it's looking. The little crisscross top. The crisscross top or the top with the twist. Here's how the shoulder seams are looking. This is your front. Imagine the hem in. And that's how that's gonna look. So now guys, what you're looking at is the sleeve. I have basted this one together so you can see how that look. And this is the neck band. And what you're seeing here on the sleeve is a dot. And it looks like that when it's unfinished. So, let's put this little crisscross top together and see how it comes out. I'm liking it already. That's so.